People don't realize that most of the time with DC current, we're not actually talking about flat, constant current. Unless we're coming from a battery or solar where we have constant flow of power in that transfer, we're actually using pulsing DC. So when you're charging your phone, you plug your phone in, you actually are having pulsing DC that's charging that phone. The problem with that is that you still have an on and an off and an on and off over and over and over. So to smooth that out and make it kind of simulate constant DC, we actually put a capacitor into a circuit and a capacitor actually shifts voltage and current. So as the voltage of the circuit is increasing, the capacitor is charging. And as the voltage decreases, the capacitor starts to release its charge. So we actually create this shift that actually makes the power right on the top, essentially, which makes it more of a ripple into a phone or anything charged or plugged in because it's 60 times a second or 120 times a second. It actually thinks that it's DC and it operates, but it's not constant DC like most people think.